All right, this is Mikey here, and I'm going to answer a quick question or explain some things to Tiger, who's a new uh, Virtual DJ user. Um, what I believe that Tiger's asking is if in deck A, at the end of the music video or song, if the video will, using auto, will go ahead and go to uh, uh, deck B. And unfortunately, it doesn't do that. What I think you're wanting to do is be able to kind of walk away for a second um, and let the next deck or the next singer, in your case, um, start without you having to uh, maybe be there. So I'm going to push play and show you that it doesn't work. All right. Um, now, there is something that you can do. Uh, to have, uh, say, your music video or music and whatnot autoplay. And I'll get to that in a second, but I do want to explain to you a couple things about um, the mixer um, and whatnot uh, in video mode. All right, right now we're in video crossfader mode. Even though we're going to hit link here, and it actually is going to link to uh, your audio uh, crossfader. But since we're in video crossfader mode, it actually does not link to your audio. So what you're going to have to do here is hit uh, your this right here, uh, tap, highlight it and tap it, and it's going to change it to audio crossfader. And just for giggles, I'm going to show you that it does work. So um, all the way to the left, uh, all the way in video mode all the way to the right now with the crossfader all the way to the right and vice versa now the audio crossfader uh, takes priority over the video so when say we're playing this song then we start lights on deck B let me just go back here so we've got the music video and this is your master out um, and now we're going to go ahead and go over to LA Lights. Well, it has automatically linked together. Let's go pause these. Um, now, what audio actually does um, is this, and it doesn't matter what mode you're in. Let's just say that I have loaded... Um, These are all music videos. Yeah, they are. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Um, basically, let's say that we push play over here. Nothing's playing over here in, in deck B, where this was at. So this was playing. It's in your master. Say we stopped deck B, and we hit play on deck A it's automatically just going to take the video over to deck A. Now, which is interesting because if you noticed here with the audio, uh, on your audio crossfader, it is to the right towards deck B. So what will happen with this audio, let's say that even though you're hearing no audio right now from deck A, if I hit play for deck B, it's automatically going to slide it back over there because it's following... Um, the audio crossfader. Now, for what you really, I think, were wanting to know is um, how to let one music video um, or karaoke file play after the other simultaneous, so, simultaneously so you could potentially walk away and use the restroom if need be. You're going to want to use this handy-dandy thing called Playlist to the side. And that will pop up automatically when you get over there. But when you let go or remove from the playlist, it's going to hide itself. I personally don't like that. So go ahead and click this little lock button here to keep that um, in check. And you can make this as big or as small as you want. I mean, uh, usually I keep it about here so I know what's going on. Um, for the auto mix, you can either click this blue uh, button here. But to be more specifically, I go ahead down here and click uh, Playlist Management. Kind of looks like a scroll. You can hit start auto mix, but before you do that, 
um, go down to Auto Mix Type, and you'll see Smart Fade, which removes uh, Intro and Outro. Uh, fade removes Silence, remove Nothing, None back to back. Smart, uh, you know, I don't use the Auto Mix feature, um, but I do know that Smart sometimes will chop, uh, find its own places where it thinks it should um, cut uh, the song, and uh, it kind of tries to beat match, but it just doesn't replace a person at all, and it's kind of sloppy. Um, but anyway, I'd probably choose remove nothing or none back to back. Um, but you can play with these and see what they do for different songs and see what uh, is suitable for your application. Um, anyway, before you hit this blue button, which starts your auto mix, all right, which will uh, enable and disable it. Um, you want to choose which deck you want to use, okay? And let's just go ahead and put uh, these songs up there. So I went ahead and told the um, the deck that I wanted to start um, by the Start Auto Mix by basically clicking on my playlist, right? So anyway, let's go ahead and start Automex. And as you can see, now it's loaded this next song, uh, which is highlighted, Rock the Boat. Uh, it's probably going to rock Phyllis. Yeah. Anyway, uh, it'll load the next song up and play for you. And just to, I guess, show you that, autoplay. Let's go to the very end of this. Oh, no, just... And now it's going to automatically transition to the next song. And that all depends on what transition you have here. I mean, you could definitely set it to none. But anyway, um, enjoy and hope that explains everything for you. Have a great day.